welcome to a welcome back to Norris Cove. I'm Yoshida. If you're new here, I'm a self-employed hairstylist. I'm also the owner of Norris Cove. And here at the Cove, we like to plan a um, budget. We would like to plan minimally and functionally using a planner. But today we're going to be using, um, we're going to be doing a flip, a first quarter flip of my personal. And I wanted to do this flip because I'm considering going to a mini HP. Um, I already have uh, mini HP as my business planner. So I'm on the fence about it, but I really, really love my personal. As I was saying, I really love my personal. She's chunky, she's thick, and I just don't know what to do. I have been carrying um, the CP Petite. Um, I got this just for my schedule so I can kind of grab this on the go just to kind of take to work, make grocery lists, things like that. I'll also do a flip of this, but I've only, <laughs> really to be honest, I started using it, um, I tried to use it in, what's this, January. Um, as you can see, I didn't do any decorating, anything like that. I didn't fill out my monthly, and it wasn't until this month, about this past week, um, I said, well, let me give CP Petite another try. And so I've kind of played around with it. Uh, let me go back, because I did plan in this last week. This is this week. I know, we're getting to the personal. Um, this is for April. I did decorate and put all my bills down for April. And this was last week. And I really enjoyed it. Um, I'm trying to get used to the the small numbers and everything. But this was just supposed to be like a kind of a replacement of this just to kind of grab and on the go. So um, we'll do a flip of this another time. But to the point is, yeah. so <laughs> let's get into it. Um, I don't have a lot. Well, I do have a lot going on. But over here in these, I have um, this pocket. I just have this uh, Casavici test list card. I have some of my favorite stickers. These were in a, excuse me, sticky notes, transparent sticky notes. They were in a recent, I want to say a January box. And I have a card, my friend's business card. Um, I have my... Um, appointment doctor's appointment card and sometimes i'll use this little card i cannot remember where i this was a freebie from somewhere and i use this to kind of plan my week and then i have this card from cloth and paper with the little sticky note i got from amazon and then this card also kind of go in size with this card I, I think it's puffin pages i'm not sure i have a little memo over here of just some um I can't think of what these are called, but <laughs> inspirational quotes, uh, affirmations. And then this was a business card of mine. And yeah, so all that's in here. In the pocket, nothing there. But what I do do, I use this here and I just have this folder from cloth and paper. I have some of our weekly expense uh, notepads. I just took a couple pieces off, stuck them back here, and one of my thank you cards because when I go to the post office, I always get asked. So I try to have, now that's my business card. So I just try to have one of those and I just have some stickers here in this card. I'm not gonna take them all out. Of course, this glass dashboard is by cloth and paper. Uh, this dashboard is by Noted uh, Co. Love her stuff. Um, Poi and Hun, Mop Shop, cloth and paper. This is a cloth and paper Kanban board. All of these page flags are from cloth and paper. Uh, cloth and paper task delegation. Oh, and then we get into the priority matrix, which is also by cloth and paper. I didn't use those as much as I thought. I kind of wanted to. Um, this is rosy paper tree. Again, these are the sticky notes from Amazon. Uh, my sticky notes. This, uh, I can't remember. I don't like these dashboards. And I just got to replace them, but I'm just not sure. But anyway, um, noted, yeah, noted code. 2024 dashboard and these are the cloth and paper monthly bundle and your glance holidays and observances cover pages 
And this was February. This was March. And then I have these um, month on one pages for that are from my shop. And I use those for content planning for my business. Oh, and then this sticky note is from 520 Creative. And then I just have the whole year of these in here. Again, these are from my shop. And I just use them for content planning for my business. And I believe these dividers are from Noted Co. as well. Uh, dashboard from my shop that was in one of our budget boxes. Um, these are my Money Gold worksheets. This was in a box. Um, we did this on live, on my IG live. We filled it out together. Another dashboard from my shop. And then this is my timed weekly schedule. Um, these are in my shop. I was going to redo them, but um, I think I'm just going to leave them because what they say, if it's not broke, don't fix it. So I just have all those together. And I might be taking those out to make room to do some more. Um, cloth and paper. I just hole punched it. Um, this is from my shop. This dashboard, intentional. Um, I don't know. Maybe cloth and paper. Um, Amazon. Um, cloth and paper. And then these weekly compass cards I make for myself and Brie over at For the Planner Girls. I only make them for us too because I can never really kind of get them right. But um, this last set turned out okay, but we'll see. Uh, cloth and paper. Cloth and paper. Just a little bit of layering there. Um, Plan with the B. Her task reminders. And then this is a habit tracker that I just designed. Um, I just stuck it in. Um, it's coming to the shop soon, but I, I have to test things out. And it's the first habit track I've ever created. So I'm excited about it. So as you can see, I just put it in for this week. And then this is my week on a page. This is in the shop. Um, just a sticky note again, that Amazon sticky note as to things to add. And this was last week. This is this week. Have a couple pages of those. And I also have one from Rosie Paper Tree. And then this is the Vertical Weekly. Um, that This is new. I got to add it to the shop. Again, I'm testing it out. <laughs> I know I, I've been working on inserts and I'm just kind of playing around with my software. I'm just getting used to uh, my design software I like. So I've just been playing around with that. So I'll probably use these again this week because I did enjoy them. And then these are weeklies from my shop as well. I always get asked why I have so many weeklies, but um, these here are like a pre-plan. Um, and then these are, I just make up my mind whichever one I want to use. I like to kind of switch it up. And then these are the horizontals. They are in my shop. And I do like these. I'm not a horizontal girl, but I do like these. I must admit, I do like these. And I'm going to design some more, so stay tuned for that. Um, noted Co. And this is a freebie. It's on my Instagram. I'm going to try to put it in the shop. But it's, if you go to my Instagram, it's a freebie. It's the daily menu, which is basically my daily routine. I believe that it is edible. I'm not sure that you could edit it yourself. But I just threw it up there. So in case somebody wanted to do it. So it's a freebie. Cloth and paper. Um, this is a daily by cloth and paper. And then... This is what I'm supposed to be. Then I created uh, my own daily because I'm trying to save some money. So it hasn't come to the shop yet, but it should. But this is what it looks like. I've been kind of playing with it, but that's what it looks like. I want to think I redid it again after this. I'm not sure. Um, cloth and paper. Cloth and paper. Noted Co. And then these are are our meal planning inserts they were in a box last year um time for some new ones and then these are i don't know what these are called graph something quads from cloth and paper i use them to basically routine plan 
What do I do on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, every day, monthly, weekly, quarterly, and yearly. And then, just again, what I'm going to declutter, I just use them as lists, kind of. And this is the note section, and I just designed these. Y'all, I've been just creating inserts, <laughs> so I will have some for a while just to play around with. So um, this is a wish list. Um, this will be coming to the shop soon, but it'll probably go out to our budget box subscribers first. And it's just a wish list of things that um, you want. Um, this is cloth and paper. Um, Fly Lady Notes, they've been in here for years. They, they'll, it'll probably stay in here until I redo it. Um, note paper from Cloth and Paper. The Duo Notes, I believe. And these are the task inserts from my shop. Um, notes, Cloth and Paper. Half Page, Cloth and Paper. Affirmations, Cloth and Paper. This dashboard is from Cloth and Paper. Cloth and paper and Ollie clip. And then this was a dashboard from one of our sub boxes last year. Uh, cloth and paper. And then this is our weekly finance assessment. And I'm about to do these again. <laughs> I think I just did those. Um, let's see. Oh, and then I found this when I was decluttering. It's like an envelope and I think I could stick something in there, but I think I'm going to take that out. Also, I found this, so I figured this would be good when I'm trying to save money, just like have a cash envelope in my planner that I can just stick in there. So I'm gonna probably keep that. Uh, savings insert from my shop. And a spending tracker from my shop. Goals, again, projects. And then this is cloth and paper. And cloth and paper. And then back here, I just have a journal card. Um, from my shop that was in a budget box, how to budget. I never remember where I got this from. This grit card, I can never remember. I don't know, but it's beautiful. And then I have these, I believe these are from Infinite Lotus or either sets of e. These cards here, I want to say Infinite Lotus. And then my money manifestation dollars back here and a card, um, daily affirmations card from Noted Co. I don't have anything. And then this little pin here I got from AliExpress. And most of the dangles here I made myself. Um, they're old. I just need to um, probably take them off. But that's it. This is my chunky um, personal planner. I love it. That's why I'm, I don't know what I'm going to do. But I'm going to set up the half letter because I just want to give it a try. But they're all going to kind of mimic each other. The CP Petite, the personal, and then I like I have things already over here for the <clears throat> mini HP. I got my disc over here. Um, I have side tabs, and what I do with the dividers, um, with the glass. So I have the glass thing, everything, and I'm just taking my time to set it up so i'm just creating more inserts to put in there so that i don't have to uh, purchase a lot but i really love my personal i was thinking about changing the cover for quarter two which i may do i may go back into my foundations planner by cloth and paper but i've just been yeah she can't close and i'm okay with it um but yeah i really do like personal so i don't know i, I just really don't know <laughs> <laughs> but that is it that is the end of my flip i'll probably do a flip on my cp petite next which is nothing much going on in here as you can see it's it's not much um i just had that daily plan in here oh yeah so this is what the daily plan looks like now this is the updated version of that daily um plan um so I guess I got kind of two in one, but I want to make sure I don't have anything personal in here first. So I'll just block that off, but there's really nothing in here because I've barely been using it. So, but she's getting chunky too. And I, I, I like that. So uh, it's a hard toss up between these two and then do mini HP. I don't know. So y'all you know, help me decide because I've been asking my Instagram friends, like I love personal. 
should I just stay in the CP Petite and Personal and just grab this one like when going to work? And then, you know, this is just everyday carry as well. And this was supposed to be like an on-the-go. And I don't know. And then just keep my mini HP business. And that's why I'm thinking I probably don't need this because... I hardly come in here. <laughs> I hardly come in my business plan, which I need to be in here tomorrow doing some work. So, yeah, I don't know. And I was just thinking about well, all the extra stuff I got. I could just add it here and try to use this on a daily basis first to see if I'm going to actually use it. So, that's it, y'all. That's, that's my dilemma. And I'm that's my dilemma. Okay, I'll talk to you guys later. Um, if you're new here and this is the f your first time watching any of my content and you enjoyed today's video, please do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. Also hit that notification bell and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.